Hi guys, welcome to Audio Media Channel. This is Sello Kumar. From now on, we are going to be having two channels. One is our usual Audio Media Channel, which will have all contents in English. If you want to see the same video in Tamil, you will have to go to a new channel, which is Audio Media Tech Channel. The link for this channel is in the description. So now let's get into this video. Every week on Friday, we are going to be showcasing a DaVinci Resolve 18 Tips and Tricks video. We will outline one tip every week. Today's topic will be Depth Mat. This is a new plugin for DaVinci Resolve 18. Let's see what it does. So now I have a video here on the timeline. So this is a footage shot at 300 FPS using the Panasonic GH6 camera. So I'll play the video clip. The playback is not smooth, but of course this is a 300 FPS clip. So what I want to do is, I want to add a title to this. So I add a title, say Saudi Media. What if I want him to run on top of the title? That is, I want this title to go behind him. To do that, I have to create a mat on him. I'll have to cut out this image and I also have to do it on a rotoscopy way because he is moving in slow motion. So I have to track him, do all this. It's a very complicated work. It will possibly take one or two hours to do. But the simple way of doing this is when type depth, DEP. So you get that plugin, depth map. So this plugin has to be applied on a layer above the text layer. So I copy this video track onto the top track and add this plugin there. So that's what I've done here already. So I put on the channel. Once I put it on, you see, now he has, the text has gone beyond him. If you look at the effects tab, you can see that we have the depth map effect here. And if I put on the transparency on, you can see that this plugin has automatically created an alpha channel for him. And if I move through the clip, you can see that it is creating alpha channel for every frame there automatically. So you don't need to track all this. You have to adjust all these parameters to get a perfect key. Once you do it, you put it off. And then for playback efficiency, it's better to go to render cache and set it to smart. So then you get a red line first. So you try to play it now. It has to turn entirely to blue for it to play smoothly. So if we try playing this couple of times, it will render and the line will turn blue. Once the line turns entirely blue, then the playback will be very smooth. So now let me try playing it back, see? So you get a beautiful playback and uh, to get the 100% quality, you have to render this clip outside. So this effect is a very complex effect. It will take a long time to do it. If you do it in the traditional method of rotoscoping and all that, it's a very cumbersome workflow. But with the depth map, it's very easily possible to create a map for this guy, which is automatically tracked also. Hope you found this video useful. To view more videos like this, Subscribe to our channel, like this video, share it with your friends. Also, don't forget to hit the bell notification so you will get a notification as and when we publish new videos. If you have any doubts on this video, please leave it in the comments and I will promptly reply to you. So, this is Selva Kumar signing out for Audio Media Channel. Thank you.